Welcome to the world of exponents. The world of exponents. The world of exponents. Yeah. Welcome to the world of exponents. Hey, I'm number three, and I'm the base. The world of exponents! The world of exponents! The world of exponents! Exponents! Welcome to our production of Exponents today. Going through a lot of the review we did yesterday. World of exponents, we have base, we have exponents. Together they make up a power. Um, we're going to be doing some practice work around similar stuff to what we did yesterday. The only thing I wanted to talk about was our calculators can make our life a lot easier when it comes to exponents. You can see on your calculator, you might have what's called a XY button. If you have an XY button on your calculator, what you can do is you can type in your base, like a three, and then hit the XY button, and that lets you then put in what the exponent is. So you'd go three, let's do it like this. If you were looking at your calculator, you would say, if it has an exponent button, you would press three, then you would press your XY button, then you would press four, and what would happen is it would give you the answer, you hit equals, and it will give you the answer of what three to the power of four, or three to the exponent four is in your calculator. There's often another one that just looks like this. On calculators, there's another button that just looks like this, x squared, because that's one of the most common exponents, right? Uh, five to the power of two, 10 to the power of two, three to the power of two. If you have an x squared button, you can just press, if you have something like 10 to the power of two, you just write 10, you hit the x squared button, and then it will show up. We know that 10 to the power of two equals Anyone know what it equals, 10 to the power of 2? I know you're thinking 20, but it's not 10 times 2, it's 10 times 10. 100, good, right? Something to the power of 2 is just itself multiplied by itself. That's really all we're going through today, just reviewing some of those concepts. Your work today, your practice work, we'll review some of those concepts again. What's the base? What's the exponent? What's the power? What does it look like in standard form? Uh, what does it look like in expanded form and in exponent form, okay? So we have, if you can, remember what they would look like and what we just had in our day in the life of the world of exponents. You have exponent form, right? Exponent for form was 3 to the power of 4. Um... Sorry, expanded form. Expanded form. Oh, our phone's ringing. We'll get them in a minute. Three times three times three times three. And standard form is what it looks like in the end when you write out that answer. 81. Okay? Enjoy. Go through. Look at the questions that we have. Work on your practice.